Hello everybody, today I want to share with you my recent Walmart shopping haul. Uh, I have to say Walmart shopping haul is my favorite video to make because I am obsessed with Walmart fashion. I love to buy clothes from Walmart not only because uh, they are affordable and their quality and style is pretty nice, also because I like to try out new things uh, and uh, you know at an affordable price and Walmart allow me to do that so I love that excite excitement I got when I received my new clothes sometimes I feel like instead of buying clothes from Walmart I'm actually buying that happiness and excitement from Walmart I'm probably talking too much anyway this time I got new uh, five items from Walmart and some of them are clothes some of them are like purses I'm going to keep three of them and be returning two of them because they just didn't work out if you interested in today's video then let's just get started the first item I want to share with you is a dress I'm wearing right now uh, I learned about this dress from another fashion video and I'm just instantly drawn to it so I know I have to order it and this one is from Time and True and I am wearing size extra small uh, I do think it fits really nice it's a nice fitted dress with a drawstring on the waist I love any dress have a drawstring because I think the waist is the best part of a woman so I'd like to show that as you can see this uh, string it's actually it's just a rope outside of the dress so it's not anything like fancy but uh, it does look pretty nice it look like it's one piece with a uh, dress instead of actually it's completely separate from the dress you can actually take the rope out you know just wear the dress without the rope there will be no problem love the wide shoulder of the dress so it hides my bra and uh, it, it makes my uh, arm line look pretty nice so that's always like my favorite kind of uh, sleeve which is white shoulder. I love this black and white color. I think it's so classy. It is a lightweight cotton material, so it definitely wouldn't make you hot in the summer. It's very lightweight and flowy. It also shows your shape. As you can see on the back, it looks like this. It does have a very long length, and I'm 5'5", five five, and you can see it's the length is really long. So. At the beginning, I was like, it's kind of too long for my taste. But later on, I feel like might as well just try something new because I don't have a dress like this. And I do think actually it makes people look pretty slender because of the length. So yeah, this one I'm going to keep it. I like it. Maybe I'll be ordering more color from this same style. Next item I want to share with you is a t-shirt I'm wearing. This t-shirt is also from time and true and this is uh, nine dollars and I forgot to mention the dress that I showed you just now that one is fifteen dollars and uh, this t-shirt is uh, like a, a little bit crop style but I don't think it's too much because you know it still got a pretty good length considering I'm wearing size extra small so I think I, I think it's got a good amount of length there. I don't think you have to size up just to because just because of the length because I think the length is perfect. If a like t-shirt length is way too long, it can kind of make you look like you have shorter legs and longer toes. So I don't think that's flattering. So this t-shirt actually I think is pretty nice. And I am obsessed with this black and white stripe. I'm it's like every single like t-shirt that I own it's like I'd love them to be black and white white strap because I just feel like they're that flattering and this t-shirt the quality is really really nice it's lightweight but not see-through at all so I really think it's a very flattering t-shirt and it won't make you hot in the summer and kind of make you look pretty young uh, so this t-shirt I'm definitely going to keep it and maybe order more color from it And now I'm going to talk about the biking short that I'm wearing uh, This biking short is from athletic work and this one I think I will be returning it I kept the tag because I have to say I'm not a big fan of Athletic work lagging because I feel like they're just not very good quality and, and they're like a loose thread everywhere 
Anyway, I see somewhere like right here on the back. I don't know if you can see it, like somewhere here. Anyway, it's just loose strings everywhere. Of course, it's black. It's not that obvious, but I mean, I just don't think it's as good quality as I like. And I ordered not. I ordered another color, like a tie dye color from the same style. I don't know why that one just seemed to be much better quality than this one. And so be aware, like different color might have different qualities. I don't know if you can see like this pocket material is actually different from the legging material. See, it's different from the legging material. It's more ribbed, which I'm not sure I like it because see, it's kind of loose on the top, which I don't know. It's not very lined up with the rest of the pants. Oh, for like $12, I can't find a better deal, like no boundary. Biking shorts is like 12 bucks for two, and I think those might be better choices for me. Here is another piece I might be returning, which uh, in my last video I did say like I'm, I will be ordering the same uh, denim shorts in the white color, which I did, uh, and here it is. Uh, it's also from Sofia Vergara, and it's $24. I'm wearing size zero. And I have to say the white uh, denim short, if it, for the same size zero, it fits tighter. Uh, but it's still it's still comfortable, and I like it because the other blue denim shorts, I do feel like it's a little bit looser than I'd like. So fitting-wise, I can say it's pretty nice. See the length and everything, uh, perfect. And the reason why I want to return it because I feel like for white shorts I do expect them to be a little bit dressier, and this one still got this uh, loose threads on the bottom, a little bit distressing. Uh, I'm not sure if that's a style that I'm looking for. Yeah, for this reason, I think maybe I'm returning them. I just want the white shorts to be you know more ladylike. And uh, this one is also very high rise and fitting wise, it's pre pretty much exactly the same. It fit me just perfect, but just the style wise, I'm not sure if I, you know, it look flattering on me. Uh, let me know what you think if I should keep it. You know, I'm still in de debate. You know, it doesn't look like horrible, but I just feel like it's not really the kind of style that I'm looking for. Here is my old. Old navy white denim shorts, and I love this one. It's more on the dressier side, and I always love to wear it. I think it's very flattering as a white denim short. I don't know what you think. Do you like this one better, or do you like that one better? The reason why I want to find a new denim short is I don't know if you can see from the side, it's just kind of like a little too big for me. So when I'm wearing tight fitting clothes, it's kind of like, you know, not look flattering. So like for this reason, I kind of want like a new white denim short that's fit me better. I have to say fitting wise, the Sofia Vergara one is more like my size right now. But I think style wise, I mean, I like the Old Navy one a lot better. I think I can still wear it with like a loose t-shirt like this. I, I think the Old Navy one is still nice, so I might just uh, uh, keep wearing this one instead. So yeah, let me know in the comment what do you think between these two shorts, which one looks more flattering in your, in your opinion. The last item I want to share with you is uh, this backpack I'm wearing right now. I always wanted a backpack backpack that is uh, very lightweight so I can use them as a you know diaper bag because you know all I'm asking from a diaper bag is they have to be lightweight and they have to be roomy I like a big pocket which I can just maximize the space in there rather than like a million small separate uh, you know pocket inside of the bag I don't like that so I but you know, for a diaper bag, I don't really want to invest in too much money in it. I just want a pretty affordable diaper bag, you know. Diaper bag is diaper bag. I don't need anything fancy. Anyway, I got this backpack from Walmart. It is only $6.99, which is exactly what I'm looking for. It's made by Nylon. 
I don't know if I can see from if you can see from the back what, what this backpack look like. I'm showing you at my best. Uh, it's like a dark green color. I bought this color because uh, this is like the cheapest color I can got, and I sort of feel like a dark green does match everything. So I just got this color, and it is extremely lightweight. Let me show you how lightweight it is. Like, see, how, that's how lightweight it. How lightweight it is. It's extremely light. It's like no weight at all. So all I don't need to worry about. I'm carrying like five pound of things. I think it probably only weigh like half half pound heavy. And also, let me show you the inside of the bag. So there is like this small. There is this small bag, like right here, which you can put like something, diaper or whatever you want to put in there. And the drawback of this bag, it doesn't have a side pocket, which you can put like a bottle of water. But I mean, for $7, what can I ask? I'll show you what's inside. And it's got a nice zipper. It's, hold on. It's a little difficult to open with one hand, but as you can see, the inside it's a little shiny material and it's just one big pocket inside. There is one separate pocket outside. It's what I need. I don't need any more. So I do think this backpack is going to fit a ton. Uh, it's by the brand Ever East and it's sort of got like a sign that look like Adidas. But nevertheless, I don't never care about the brand. I just think this bag is practical and they look okay. So yeah, I'm definitely gonna be keeping this one for $7. I mean, it's definitely worth it. Okay, everybody, that's everything I want to share with you today from my Walmart shopping haul. Please leave a comment and let me know which piece is your favorite. And I hope this video is helpful to you. If you liked this video, please give me a thumb up and subscribe to my channel. I will see you next time. Bye.